us. Where are you going? Preaching at Bishaw, at the Church of the Quivering Brethren. They am all burn in hell. And someone's got to tell them so. But may I come with you? I think you'll escape from the fires of hell if you come along with me and bow down and quiver. It's just too late, young lady. You'll burn with the rest. Well, I should like to see it, even so. Why are they called quivering, brethren? Why? Because they quiver when they prepare for torment. Do you prepare your sermons beforehand, or does it just come? The word is never prepared. It falls on my mind like manna from heaven. Really? How interesting. Then you have no idea what you're going to say before you get there. I, I always know it'll be somewhat about burning. And does anyone else preach, or are you the only one? Only me. Deborah Check Bottom, she tried once ways to get up and preach, but she couldn't. The Lord weren't in her. Secretly out of your doomed houses to hear what's coming to you. Aye. Have you come, old and young, sick and well, matrons and virgins? If there be any virgins amongst you, which is not likely the world being in the wicked state that it is, Aye. have you come to hear me tell you of the great crimson licking flames of hellfire? have come, dozens of you, like rats to the granary, like field mice when there's harvest home. And what good will it do you? You are all damned! Oh, oh, damned! Oh, you never oh, stop oh, to oh, think what that word means. Oh, no, oh, you don't. It means oh, endless, oh, horrifying torment. It means your poor sinful body stretched out on red hot gridirons in the nethermost fiery pit of hell, and those demons mocking you while they wave cooling jellies in front of you. You know what it's like when you burn your heart, taking a cake out of the oven, or lighting one of them godless cigarettes. And it stings with a fearful pain, aye. And you run to clap a bit of butter on it to take the pain away, aye. Well, I tell you, there'll be no butter in hell. And your body will be burning and stinging with that terrible pain. And your blackened tongue will be sticking out of your mouth. And your parched lips will be crying out, <laughs> 